Yeah. I'm sitting there reading this book, right? And I'm like, I'm just going to send y'all a message that y'all know. Y'all need to get this book right here. Y'all see it good? Knowledge yourself. Ain't no religious book or nothing like that. It's a good book. It's about, about you. Y'all need to have this. Go get that book. Order it on Amazon.com. It's called Knowledge Yourself by Supreme Understanding. Once you get it, you're going to love it. Make it fit your life. You're going to love it. Also, I was sitting here. I might sit here and study. So when y'all see me, I might post something. It ain't just came out of nothing. It came out of here. See, that's my knowledge of self. See, then they go on and on. All the way to all degrees. My lessons. My supreme math. My supreme alphabet. Like I just told y'all something. I think I just posted a little while ago. Queen. Let me see if y'all can see it. Let's say Queen. It's real life. This ain't no religion in It's just knowing yourself. Let me go all the way down to all. That's just the alphabet and the math. You got Student enrollment. You got lessons one twenty one fourteen. You got C lessons one thirty six. Study all of them. See all them lessons right there. I study them every day. One forty lessons. That's forty of these. And they go on and on. Let me see. You got actual facts. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know what actual facts? Like an actual fact is the 10th degree. And my actual facts would be the earth is, how far is the earth from the sun? Y'all know. It's 93 million miles. It's an actual fact. It's good to know. And, I, you know, there's a lot of things that go along with that, too. <laughs> you got solar facts. See that? Solar facts. Give you everything you need to know about the solar system and everything. You got plus degrees. I got a lot of here. A whole bunch of stuff. So, when y'all see me post something, it's coming out of this. It ain't just coming out of... And I got it all memorized, too, so you can ask me any question in this book, and I'm going to know it, because I got it all memorized. I'm about to finish reading this book, though. And then this book is about... Let me see. It's a bunch of different good chapters in here. Let me show y'all, see if y'all can show y'all something right fast. Just for example, what's something in here? Some, something in here might be where you'd be interested, that you might not even know. Can y'all see that? I see on one side, see this is a picture of a brain cell. It looks just like this picture, but this is a picture of the universe. So a brain cell looks just like a cell in the universe like a like a universal you know like a cell in the you know like a molecule or you know atoms in the universe it's the same thing that's in your brain cell it's the same thing in the universe like so when i say you in the universe oh it's one it ain't symbolic same thing that's in your body is in the universe same thing that's in like when they went and found the bone of the first person on the planet. I think it was female Lucy. Just for example, use her name, you know, for that. That's when this one they found. And her DNA exists. Her DNA. They found the DNA of everything that exists. So if you go look up a frog and peep his DNA, it was in her bone. Plants is in her bone. You know what I'm saying? Everything was in her DNA. Everything is in your DNA. You know what I'm saying? If you go pull up a a, a meteor out the sky, it falls to the ground, they pick it up and go and dig in and look at these molecules and everything, the DNA, just the DNA of that is going to be in your DNA because everything exists. Everything. 
is in your DNA because you are everything. You're original. You created everything. Figure that out. Peace.